A master class on Bain Kekar, part 1, episode 69, written by Thomas Frank, last updated, 27 July 2015. Oh, this is watching episode. Unless you plan to move it to New York, or San Francisco or some other big city after you graduate, you'll probably have by a car at some point. Maybe your old Civic Beater will last you a couple years after you graduate. Maybe it'll blow up tomorrow while you're on your way to class. Either way, I will learn it, uh, that it's smart idea to know what to look for and uh, how to get a good deal when the time to go car shopping comes around. My mom has been uh, drilling this fact into my head since I was in high school. Uh, make sure you are putting away some money each month in case you need to get a new car. And a few weeks ago, it uh, finally happened. A friend's car blew up, so I decided to sell him my old Chevy and uh, look for something new. Knowing that the person with the most information will win any negotiation, I made sure to do an epic amount of research before even walking into a dealer. Along the way, I come across Everyday Driver, a YouTube channel and podcast hosted by two uh, certified car uh, geeks, uh, Todd Deacon and Paul Schmecker. Todd and Paul uh, focus their YouTube efforts uh, on uh, fun cars, but their podcast was the thing that uh, really intrigued me. No need, they take uh, scenarios from listeners and provide car recommendations uh, that uh, fit them. That includes budget, lifestyle, whether or not they have guides uh, where they live ATC. Listening to their podcast opening, my mind to just how many choices I had when it come to car buying. It also well, kind of turned me into a car geek so well. Seriously, I've been playing uh, Darl Rolly for weeks uh, now not I spend half of my July f- uh, 4th uh, vacation reading up now how I to work. It's uh, actually pretty interesting. Uh, going through the car geek uh, phase uh, talk to me uh, something uh, though. Driving even on a budget uh, can be fun. There are cars uh, out there that uh, can fit your budget and not make you hate yourself every time you have to drive them. So, after learning uh, Tom from Todd and Paul and uh, them actually getting my old car, I thought uh, it would be great to have them on the podcast. I wanted to pick their brains and uh, get really in depth on the car buying process and I definitely got what I was after. In fact, we ended uh, up uh, chatting for almost to full house. Uh, for that reason, uh, we decided to make this a two-parter, a veritable masterclass on how to buy a car. So after you were listening uh, to this episode and the one coming out next week, you'll know how to. Search for cars uh, that uh, fit your needs and that can uh, be fun. Analyze a usage car for potential problems. Test drive the right way. Uh, negotiate properly with a dealer. Finance a car without getting scraped. And probably a lot more enjoy. 
things mentioned in this episode everyday drive on youtube listen to the everyday driver car debate podcast after trainer gar cars killer blue block car facts consumer reports come out time map checklist of this to look for on a used car have to negotiate with the dealer Uh, one last tip, uh, if you find yourself uh, needing to buy a car and you are still um, feeling lost after this episode, uh, there is uh, no harm in asking someone more experienced to, to come along with you. Uh, it could be your dad, uh, your grandma or even a friendly professor, people who have owned uh, uh, multiple cars uh, will simply have uh, more experience and knowledge of what uh, to look for, so um, consider it. Want more cool stuff? Uh, you can find uh, all sorts uh, of great lots uh, at my research page. If you enjoyed this episode, subscribe to the podcast on iTunes. It's easy, you'll get new episodes automatically and it also helps the show gain explore. You can also thank you, watch friend. Bye.